Hey guys, at BV Matson here, and today we're installing a peephole. So just like every project, it's always very important to read the instructions. Now before we read the instructions, there's something that we need. The most important item that you're going to need to complete this very complex home improvement project is at least one, but preferably six Sierra Nevada Pale Ales. Be sure to read the instructions carefully in a language you understand. All right, now that you've read the instructions, it's time to place a mark on the door for where you're gonna put your peephole. Now, I'm a little bit taller than my wife, so it's supposed to be at eye level, but I think we're gonna meet in the middle here. So my eye level's about here. I'm gonna say right about there is gonna be about right for the installation of the peephole. So I'm just gonna loosely put a little dot on the door and that's gonna mark the spot where we start drilling our holes. So now that you've marked the spot on the door where you want to drill your holes to install your peephole, you gotta find center because you don't want it all wonky. Now I can't find my tape measure no big deal, because I do have a piece of paper. I'm simply going to lay the piece of paper along the panel that I need and make a mark on the other end. Then I'm simply going to fold the piece of paper to match the line that I just drew. Line up that, fold with that, and now I have an accurate center in which to drill. And now it's time to drill. But before we drill or use any power equipment, be sure to use proper safety equipment. Let's run through that next. Get yourself a mask. Keep in mind that we are drilling into an insulated door. And when we drill, there is a huge chance that debris will be coming out, could go into our lungs, and who knows what that could mean later on down the road. Next, you really need to wear safety goggles. We're drilling into a metal door. That means metal shavings flying all over the place. You could get these in your eye and that could be extremely painful. And finally, with any construction project as serious as this, there is always the risk for falling debris. Highly recommend utilizing a helmet to protect the dome. All right, we're ready to go. We've got our mark spot right here. We're ready to do this. We have the 1 8 drill bit into our drill. It's tight. It's not going to do anything. And what we're going to do is we're slowly going to drill through the door, through both sides of the door. Okay, uh, minor detail here. You're gonna wanna remember to put the battery on the charger before you start your project. So, um, looks like we're, we're, we're gonna have a, a little bit of a break here. While I was waiting for the battery to charge on that drill, I took some time to go check out some videos from The Lawn Care Nut and also my friend Steve Sharon. There's some great content over there. Give them a subscribe, give them a thumbs up. I think you'll really enjoy it. But back to the peephole business. All right, we're ready to get going again. We got some juice in the drill and we're ready to drill that pilot hole. Again, an eighth inch bit all the way through the door. And it looks like we have a nice hole here. Let's open the door. Take a look at this side, and we got a perfect little hole here. See, now here's why you should actually be really careful, because this is really, really sharp little metal shard there. But now we're ready to drill the big hole. All right, we've changed bits. We're now using the 5 ace bit to fit the bore of the peephole. we still got juice, and we're ready to drill the holes. Now what you want to do here is drill from each side. So go from the front and go from the back. You don't want to just push all the way through the door like we did with the eighth inch. Let's see how it goes. and we'll flip over to the other side. 
Now that we've completed that first run through, all we got to do is go meet in the middle. And there we have it. We've drilled a hole in our door. Let's do a little cleanup. So there we go. We got our hole. It's going all the way through nice and level as well. I tell you what, that pilot hole is absolutely key. Use that small bit, get yourself a starter hole. It's big, big, big deal. Now I've got a little bit of a raised edge here, so I'm just gonna use this hammer. Knock that off a little bit there, and uh, we should be ready to rock and roll with the installation of the peephole. So, so here is what the actual peephole looks like. It's two pieces, see how it's threaded? Uh, it comes apart, so we're gonna simply take this piece and that's going to go on the exterior of the door and this piece is going to slide into the door, meet it and tighten it in. So let's go ahead and uh, see how it fits. So here we're looking at the exterior of the door. We're simply going to take this piece and drop it into here. That's what it's going to look like on the outside. Pretty cool, right? Nice and centered. Looks really, really nice. Now we're going to flip the door around and you'll actually see the uh, piece right in here. So what we're going to do is we're going to take this piece and we're just going to meet those two in the middle and tighten them together. The only thing that's really left to do is to tighten these two pieces. Looking through it, it's absolutely perfect. All right. I feel so much more secure by having this in place. My wife or I can walk up to the front of the door and look right through it. So let me show you how to tighten it up to get it all snug and ready to go. So let's tighten it up. The easiest way to tighten this baby up is with a hammer and a flathead screwdriver. Because if you look closely at the piece, there's a little notch built right into the piece. And if you tap it around, it gets nice and tight. That baby is not going anywhere. I think our peephole installation is complete. Let's see if we can give you a look through it. And that's really all there is to it. Essentially, all you're doing is drilling a pilot hole and drilling a hole that matches the size of the peephole that you purchase. It's a nice, clean installation, looks fantastic, matches all the different brass elements throughout the house. And I got to tell you, it's not a six pack job. It's really not even a single beer job. It's a uh, maybe a couple sips of coffee and call yourself a new peephole owner. That sounds kind of weird, but it was a fun little Saturday morning project and uh, had a lot of fun making the video. Thanks for watching. If you have questions, leave them in the comments below. Um, otherwise, look for more videos in the future. Thanks, everybody. Have a great day.